Swayam Prabha. Digital India. Educated India. Welcome to this course on transition metal organometallics in catalysis and biology. We have been uh, discussing about a very important uh, reaction which is called Repe synthesis particularly that involves conversion of acetylene to various chemical functionalized feedstocks uh, uh, and was developed in early 1900 by Walter Rappe. Now uh, we in the last lecture we have looked into the context in which uh, the rapid chemistry was developed and based uh, on the need of the hour of de looking for uh, the application or utility of acetylene which was produced uh, uh, from uh, the coal uh, uh, as its major source uh, the repe uh, reaction uh, became relevant. Uh, a great deal of uh, developments in repe chemistry uh, had been uh, performed are obtained uh, at, uh, under industrial conditions and that is why uh, the repay synthesis can be called as a gift of industry to the field of organometallic chemistry. Now uh, this uh, uh, discussion that I have covered in the last uh, uh, lecture as well as part of what I will be covering now has been uh, 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 nicely reviewed uh, in a American Chemical Society ACS uh, uh, review article uh, which I am going to give the reference uh, today for people to look up. The title is Catalytic Reactions of Acetylene a Feedstock for the chemical industry revisited. And uh, the reference is chem chemical review 2014 one six seven one to one seven eight two. So this is a nice uh, review uh, which uh, sort of uh, discusses uh, the importance of repeat chemistry not only at the time when it was developed even the relevance of the development of repeat re chemistry even under today's context and is a beautiful review uh, through uh, which uh, I have also covered uh, in the last and part of last lecture and part of uh, uh, the, the present lecture and uh, would request all the uh, viewers uh, uh, of this course uh, to look up uh, if they want to look uh, read uh, about the developments of rapid chemistry in much more uh, details. Mm -hmm. Now uh, the what we had uh, earlier also discussed that rapi chemistry involves a set of uh, large number of reactions and the most common or the most important uh, type of rapi reactions are uh, vinylation reactions. And uh, what we had seen that in these vinylation reactions acetylene is converted to various vinyl derivatives and in our previous class we have discussed about how acetylene getting converted uh, uh, to uh, vinyl alcohol by reaction in presence of uh, a base uh, like potassium hydroxide as well as another example of vinylation which we had uh, uh, read about or spoken about in the last class uh, was about reaction of acetylene with hydrogen cyanide HCN in presence of uh, uh, catalyst in giving acrylonitrile nitrile for the vinylation reaction. Another example of vinylation reaction which we are going to be uh, taking up today is the reaction with HCl. And this is uh, called vinyl chloride.
Now, uh, 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 if you remember, as I had said uh, in my earlier class, uh, uh, that there was a parallel development uh, about uh, accessing all of these uh, uh, products which were obtained through LEPI using other methods, particularly uh, from that of the feedstocks from uh, natural gas and oil, uh, crude oil, which is ethylene. For example, uh, I had spoken about how focus of the industry shifted on conversion of acetylene to acetaldehyde uh, in presence of uh, uh, water uh, by reaction of uh, water with acetylene in presence of acid and mercury plus uh, 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 to that of conversion of ethylene to acetaldehyde, the same product acetaldehyde one obtained from acetylene uh, in repi type chemistry and the other obtained through uh, wacker oxidation, uh, which also is an industrial process uh, developed for ut uh, consumption or util utilization of ethylene, which are obtained as a product in petrochemical industry from natural oil and crude oil. So, uh, similar to the development for acetaldehyde, which could also be obtained from acetylene and uh, ethylene, similar development also has been uh, 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 obtained uh, from ethylene for uh, the current purpose. And uh, the corresponding development is uh, in presence of chlorine and oxygen, it gives huh. so this, uh, as uh, I said is an in interesting development where, whereby one uh, could see that uh, uh, the same product uh, 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 was obtained from two different substrates, uh, one from acetylene and another from ethylene uh, as the time progressed and the focus shifted uh, uh, from utilizing ethylene source to that of utilizing uh, 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 it, uh, olefin, olefinic ethylene source to that of using acetylene source. The focus shifted as a result, uh, the technology shifted, the reaction shifted. However, the product obtained from both of these reactions remains the same. So, this is a beautiful example where one can see that how chemistry uh, accommodates uh, different transformation uh, 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 from different sources to give the same product as per the need uh, uh, and the demand of the time. So, this is a beautiful example. Another example we had also seen similarly acetaldehyde uh, could be obtained from acetylene as well as could be obtained from ethylene and both uh, have been developed te uh, uh, technologically a, a for uh, large scale industrial uh, productions. So, uh, we continue further on this uh, vinylation reactions. Uh, we are going to take up uh, uh, the reaction uh, uh, with uh, uh, carboxylic acids. And uh, uh, the interesting thing about it that this also requires a uh, metal catalyst and uh, if ruthenium uh, is used as the catalyst, uh, then uh, uh, the reaction proceeds at a much milder conditions and uh, uh, with high uh, selectivity. Ruthenium is used the reaction proceeds under milder conditions and with high regioselectivity. selectivity. 
I will explain this with this example R 1 C O O H reacting with R 2 C H. It is a terminal acetylene in presence of ruthenium as a catalyst more milder conditions about 60 to 80 degree centigrade resulting in two product R 1 O R 2 plus R 1 O R 2. So, one can see that two different kind of uh, olefinic bonds are here uh, uh, where O and R 2 are cis where O and R 2 are, uh, are trans we designate this as A and B and uh, uh, with ruthenium being the catalyst uh, the selectivity is primarily A and which is formed about uh, 93 to 99 percent. So, what we see is that uh, ruthenium uh, brings in great amount of selectivity uh, in the formation of these two uh, compounds and also ruthenium uh, uh, brings in uh, no, uh, these uh, milder reaction conditions uh, in which uh, uh, this reaction proceeds. So, uh, we are going to uh, uh, move on to uh, see another very interesting uh, uh, synthesis uh, of uh, acrylic acid uh, using uh, Repi method. And uh, this uh, uh, involves hydrocarboxylation what is the meaning of uh, hydrocarboxylation uh, it means that simultaneous addition of hx uh, as well as uh, co And this is given by the reaction in presence of catalyst to give uh, uh, this uh, acrylic acid. Now, as mentioned earlier uh, 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 in case of ac uh, vinyl uh, cyanide as vinyl chloride, vinyl alcohol, acrylic acid too is an important monomer for uh, variety of uh, uh, polymerization processes and hence uh, is of great demand in the industry. Uh, here uh, one can see the base catalyst use are uh, homoleptic as well as heteroleptic uh, iron carbonyl complexes. So, uh, oh, like metal carbonyl complexes like cobalt uh, tetracarbonyl hydride, nickel tetracarbonyl or iron pentacarbonyl uh, are extremely good uh, catalyst uh, for these RP uh, synthesis. Now, uh, one should or may argue that how come uh, these uh, are uh, behaving as a catalyst because all of these complexes are uh, both uh, electronically saturated. Uh, as well as coordinatively saturated. Now, we had had an elaborate discussion on electronic uh, 
uh, saturation and uh, coordinative saturation uh, in our previous course where we said that uh, prerequisite for uh, behaving as a catalyst is the requirement of electronic uh, unsaturation as and as well as coordinative uh, unsaturation. Now, if one were to look at uh, all of these complexes, uh, 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 one would see that they have 18 valence electron counts and also have about 4 or 5 uh, uh, coordination number. Uh, so, what does that mean? Uh, tell us that uh, these are uh, not the real catalyst, but uh, uh, most likely or obviously are the pre catalyst uh, uh, for uh, the reaction. What does it mean is that they uh, lose uh, uh, carbon monoxide, uh, one or two of them, to become electronically as well as coordinatively unsaturated. Uh, when they participate in the uh, catal catalytic cycle as uh, uh, pre uh, uh, as the active species uh, active catalytic species for carrying out this transformation so uh, uh, we see that uh, these complexes metal carbonyl complexes like cobalt hydride tetracarbonyl nickel uh, tetracarbonyl and iron pentacarbonyl are very good catalysts uh, uh, for converting acetylene to uh, uh, acrylic acids and uh, the same uh, uh, using these methods acrylates can also be made uh, from acetylene CO and uh, alcohol using this method acrylates Uh, uh, acrylates uh, op can be obtained from acetylene CO and alcohol. So, uh, uh, what it says that uh, this method uh, 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 is uh, very uh, uh, common a generic one where one can uh, replace water uh, with uh, alcohol and in presence of uh, forming acrylic acid one can also form uh, acrylates acrylic ester uh, using the uh, same uh, method. So, uh, this uh, further highlights uh, the versatility uh, of uh, this transformation that we just uh, uh, spoke about. Now, uh, we would like to uh, give uh, example uh, of how this reaction uh, proceeds uh, uh, in terms of uh, the catalytic cycle. As mentioned uh, earlier that nickel tetracarbonyl uh, is both uh, electronically as well as coordinatively saturated uh, uh, because uh, it has 18 valence electron. Uh, so, it uh, when it reacts uh, with uh, Hx uh, for let us say for this hydrocarboxylation uh, prior to that it loses uh, 2 uh, CO and Hx uh, undergoes oxidative addition to give H Ni uh, uh, CO 2 X. Uh, so, uh, uh, as uh, is common for oxidative addition one can see that uh, uh, the oxygen state of nickel has gone from nickel 0 to nickel 2. Uh, uh, by the addition of this uh, Hx. Now, uh, uh, once this is formed, uh, then uh, the acetylene uh, uh, reaction uh, takes place uh, with this uh, species. And the uh, nickel, uh, uh, the nickel hydride, uh, uh, nickel hydride add across uh, the acetylene giving uh, uh, this nickel uh, uh, vinyl bound nickel uh, species which is drawn over here now uh, once uh, uh, this is formed uh, then Uh, 
uh, uh, one of the, uh, the CO which is liberated Uh, uh, comes in and undergoes and uh, goes an insertion uh, uh, into the nickel carbonyl uh, bond. Uh, this is sort of uh, what is called migratory insertion uh, to give this compound and then subsequent reaction subsequent reaction with alcohol uh, gives the vinyl ester and uh, 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 would give back uh, the uh, uh, initial starting uh, uh, catalyst uh, that uh, uh, one uh, uh, started off with. And this uh, is a, a good monomer uh, for uh, uh, acrylic acid uh, or polyacrylate. So, this is a polymer polyacrylates and they can be uh, uh, obtained by uh, uh, polymerizing this monomer or this uh, acrylate esters. And what we see is here is a Nouns demonstration of uh, uh, hydrocarboxylation Uh, nice demonstration of hydrocarboxylation uh, which uh, had resulted uh, uh, in uh, uh, production of uh, 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 acrylic esters and they are important feedstock for uh, polyacrylates or the polymer. And these uh, uh, again highlights the importance of rapey chemistry in terms of uh, 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 producing this important uh, monomer uh, uh, through a large scale industrial process and by which also utilizing uh, acetylene uh, uh, as one of the uh, uh, sources feed, uh, of feedstock uh, from coal uh, to produce the monomer uh, acrylates and then uh, they are also used for another industrial process of polymerization uh, uh, giving uh, polyacrylates. With that, uh, we had uh, 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 come into uh, 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 discussing the end of vinylation uh, reactions uh, that uh, uh, are used uh, for uh, making uh, the vinyl derivatives, which can be halide, ester, acid, and uh, uh, the cyanides uh, from acetylene feedstock. And then uh, we move on to another interesting topic uh, which uh, in rapid reaction or rapid chemistry another set of reaction which are called ethyl, uh, ethylation reactions. And this reaction involves addition of acetylene and its removable proton. And its removable protons. across a carbonyl group uh, 
and uh, and these are similar to one to addition and employs copper for this uh, chemistry. CO2, C2, water 80 to 100 degree centigrade, 2 to 6 bar pressure produces CH2OH that reacts with aldehyde to give CH2, C, C, CH2, OH and that in presence of hydrogen and Rani nickel, nickel produces 1,4 butane diol. So, uh, these uh, uh, is an important uh, 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 demonstration of how acetylene uh, 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 can be uh, used to convert, uh, uh, can be used to undergo this ethylenation reaction uh, uh, like this acetylide uh, CH adding across this carbon CO group and giving CH2H and then another reaction uh, over at that uh, other end to giving 2 CH2 uh, OH and uh, uh, that under reduction giving this 1,4 butane diol. So, uh, in the current examples uh, the addition of uh, the addition of alkanyl uh, CH across uh, one CO group as well as uh, the second CH across the second CO group resulting in CH2H, CH2H uh, which under reduction give important intermediate 1,4 butane. Uh, diol. So, with this uh, we come to an end of uh, today's lecture. In this uh, we have looked into the react various types of reactions of AP chemistry particularly with re regard to the vinylation reactions in which the acetylene uh, moiety has been reacted uh, uh, with uh, uh, a, uh, various kinds of reagent like HCl, uh, HCN uh, uh, acids, es uh, esters to give uh, various kind of vinyl. Uh, acid, cyanide, esters, ac acrylates. Uh, we have also looked into the mechanism in which uh, how uh, acrylates uh, 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 esters were obtained uh, from reaction of acetylene, carbon monoxide and HX. These are called hydrocarboxylation reaction and then uh, with that we had uh, come to an end of vinylation reactions and then uh, in the end we have looked into another new uh, type of reaction of rapid chemistry which are called ethylenation uh, reaction uh, that involves the reaction of acetylene uh, with a carbonyl group and which uh, uh, also resulted uh, finally uh, to the conversion of 1,4 propane diol. So, with this uh, we uh, come to our current discussion on rapid chemistry in today's class. We are going to uh, be looking into some more important applications of uh, rapid, uh, rapid reaction, rapid chemistry as we take up uh, in the next uh, class. I hope uh, you have enjoyed uh, 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 this, uh, uh, the content which has been discussed uh, today uh, in this uh, with regard to rapid chemistry. We look forward to some more exciting reactions and developments uh, uh, on rapid reactions as we cover the topic in bit more detail uh, in, in the next class. T till then goodbye and see you in the next class. Thank you.